Yeah, no, I think you're absolutely right. And, um, you know, we have, we have to first look at our antitrust statutes. Um, number one, you know, these are statutes that were mostly written during the railroad monopolies, which, you know, was a very different time and a very different economy. So part of it is, you know, part of what the committee will do is we'll start kind of a top to bottom review. Do the antitrust statutes actually work today? Do they have the, the right, you know, elements to be sure that we're promoting competition? Then we have to make sure the antitrust agencies like the SEC, FTC, all the people who are responsible for promoting competition are funded you know, so that they can actually uh, do their enforcement work. Uh, and then I think we have to prohibit certain practices. Like right now, I mean, maybe people don't know this, but a lot of fast food restaurants have non-compete provisions in the contracts of people. Now think about that. You talk about reducing the power of the worker. Like what is the basis of a non-compete so you can't go from McDonald's to Wendy? I mean, it's ridiculous. Forced mandatory arbitration, another example that really reduces the power of the consumer or the worker. So there's a number of things we can do to just prohibit behavior, anti-competitive behavior, which we're gonna do. And then there are a number of things we can do in terms of you know, providing resources to the agencies. But you are 100% right, and that's why I wanted to be on this and chair this subcommittee. So change is coming. <laughs>